Well, hey, are we on again? <laughs> oh, we were just talking amongst ourselves. <laughs> hey, Tommy. Are you yeah, there? Oh, well, there he is. We were we didn't see anything. We thought we were on a break. But we're glad we're not. We're glad we're with you, Tommy. Glad you didn't we didn't say I'm more. Glad, yeah. <laughs> we're just I talking didn't think it's appropriate. No, we were just talking about a duet someday we might do. Hmm. Yeah. Someday. Not yeah, not on the show. <laughs> How are I'm you? Tommy Cunningham. I'm with the Dallas Morning News. Been there a few years. Um, Garth, I'm an Okie. Oh, where from? Uh, yeah. You follow Oklahoma. You betcha. Yeah, I'm from Yukon. Yeah. I'm down outside Oklahoma City. At one time, I'd heard about you as a wishbone quarterback for Yukon High. Yeah, we ran the eye, <laughs> but yeah, yeah. I was, well, I was horrible, yes. <laughs> so it's good you stayed in country <laughs> music. <laughs> yeah. I heard you stepped aside your senior year, and uh, you ended up going to OSU on a track scholarship, so that was cool. Yeah, I was lucky enough my brother got that taken care of me. So my whole life, people have taken care of me. Just kind of like uh, what's going to happen on the I'm ACMs. Gonna take care of She's going to take great care of me. <laughs> on the ACMs. <laughs> All right, well, I'll set your questions here. Um, uh, leads me kind of to the first question on your athletic ability. Are you uh, are you going to be uh, doing that swing entrance anymore? Is that something you're going to go into this summer? No, I'm going to try walking on stage for the first time ever in my career. Uh, so we'll uh, we'll see how that goes. But uh, I think I, I got to tell you, the beginning and the end of this show is what I'm looking for because I get to introduce Dolly, and then at the same time, mm -hmm. her performance is going to be the last one of the night. So. Whatever happens in between, that's going to be cool. But I can tell you right now, we're all waiting uh, for the very last performance. And when he introduces me, I'm going to be the one swinging <laughs> <I got to laughs> see on Garth's that. equipment. <laughs> <laughs> he volunteered to let me use it. <laughs> I think you guys remember that Tarzan swing of his. That was pretty cool. Oh, was yeah. Good. Yeah, he that is Tarzan. <laughs> that's what it is. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah, I think that'd be pretty cool to do at the Star in Frisco. I don't know if you guys checked out the joint yet but the it's, it's pretty pretty cozy pretty you know intimate yeah i think it's going to be perfect it's uh, uh i've seen it pretty much just on drone footage I haven't got to stand in there yet but i've also seen the the sketches of what the award show is going to look like the backdrops are the performance areas it, it looks fantastic and and you know it's it's amazon it's the acms you know they're gonna go over the top okay um one thing I wanted to ask you, uh, and I'll get to you, Dolly, here in a little bit, but uh, that's okay. I, I can you, wait. I like to know about him too. The more I can learn, <laughs> the better we'll be. <laughs> uh, I know uh, Garth is familiar with Dallas. He did a lot of his uh, start up here, and he played a lot of the local places. And uh, what kind of a, what kind, you get different receptions at different places where you play? Is there anything unique about the one here in Dallas? Uh, no, the thing, the thing that's unique about Dallas is you're not going to have a bad time. You, you can roll into a city that you always, and some nights it just doesn't work. It's never not worked in Dallas. And then here's the craziest thing. The last time we were there, we played AT&T uh, toward the end of the stadium tour, and it was the best time I'd ever had in Dallas. And come on, man, I've, I've played Dallas 80 times, and every time mm -hmm. is amazing. But that last time, that's freaking crazy. So it just makes me feel good. It makes me feel like the music maybe has made the leap and uh, because uh, it was very sweet to see all ages and all of them knew all the words. It was it was very flattering. That's always fun. No, it's, it's makes great. Makes you feel good. And, and, you know, as an Oklahoma <laughs> kid, you think they're going to barbecue you there in Texas, but they've always treated me like a native son, and I'm sure you probably feel the same way, that they just open up their doors, and if you're sincere, you belong in Texas. Yeah, the only thing that separates us is the Red River. That's yeah. about it. Okay. Um, and I know you shared stages with the greats of all time, but uh, what's, what's, what's the special vibe on sharing this with Dolly? Uh, I don't know, because, you know, we're, we're gonna, uh, I'm trying to take all your time, but uh, when you talk about the GOAT, for me, that GOAT has always been haggard. If we could sound like anybody, we'd sound like George Jones. Straight is my hero. But when you put all the things that make up the GOAT, entertaining, songwriting, awards, all that stuff, and the length of career, 
I think I am sitting next to the goat. I really do. Are you calling me the goat? <laughs> what does I, that stand for? I, I really, really do. The greatest of all time. I, oh, I've I do. heard and that. And I, didn't, I thought, I'm, that's an insult. I'm not saying that because you're sitting here, but <laughs> you, you do any kind of research on this woman right here. Her career, we would all want a tenth of her career. Well, I've lived a right. long time, <laughs> Garth. <laughs> I need to get to Dollar real quick here. Um, uh, what is what is your special memories about performing in Dallas? I know you've been here several times. Well, I have done every movie that I've done. I've been a, a girl from Texas, you know. Mm -hmm. Even the, mm -hmm. and so uh, even best little, uh, you know, uh, roadhouse in Texas. You can say. I guess I better say <laughs> best little chicken house in Texas. But I've always loved the people there. It's kind of like he's like he says he's an oaky. How they they're so accepting and they love mm -hmm. that. I think if you got a country accent. They'll accept you. They, you know, they know if you got a good heart, country heart, they accept you. So I've been, I've performed there several times and love the audience because they, they don't mind having a good time <laughs> and they don't mind showing you that they appreciate you. Mm -hmm. So we're looking forward to doing the show there. Are we not in the same building where the Cowboys? That's where they uh, practice. Practice yes. and all that. Yeah. So, uh, but yeah, Texas is great. T for Texas, T for Tennessee. And I've uh, I've got a lot of fans in that part of the world looking forward to doing our show from there. Yeah, a lot has been going on in Texas with country music with the um, you know another award show in Austin. So it seems to be get, becoming kind of a mecca now. Yeah, uh, well I've done the ACMs before last year even, but there are different places, different times. I think we were in Vegas last yeah. year. But we're looking forward to being in Texas this year, and I'm looking forward to working with the cowboy when he gets his cowboy hat on. <laughs> he looks like my husband now, like he might go out and mow the yard. <laughs> I just I just heard Dolly Parton say I look like her husband. That was enough for me. <laughs> <laughs> well, he's well, Dolly. Like Please reconsider that Tarzan swing. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, that, I think I'm, I'm getting the hook here. Oh, thank you. Well, thank I, you. I appreciate it, pal. Tommy. <laughs>